I'm meteorologist Mark Van Cuso, and on this day in weather history, April 9, 1947, a system of tornadoes swept through Texas, Oklahoma, and Kansas. The Glacier Higgins Woodward tornadic event was similar to the tri state tornado of two decades before, and that it appeared to observers as a single, very long lived tornado. Later analysis suggested that it was a multiple tornado outbreak. The tornadoes began in Texas and would cut a path of destruction through three states, ending near St. Leo, Kansas. When it struck and completely destroyed the small town of Glacier, it may have been as much as two miles wide. Afterwards, press reports told of two people that were found three miles apart who were known to be together before the storm struck. Much of Higgins, Texas was completely destroyed. The system then ransacked Oklahoma, where it passed through Woodward with a two-mile wide track, wiping out 107 people and destroying 100 city blocks. Cleanup in the region was made more difficult because of the cold and snow that followed. Roughly 4,000 buildings and homes were leveled or heavily damaged, costing half a billion dollars in today's figures. The Glacier Higgins Woodward tornadoes were the sixth deadliest in U.S. history, killing 181 and injuring 970. I'm Mark Biancuso.